Hi folks, this is episode 4 uh, in my Witcher playthrough. So we are just now going to be making a potion to cure our lovely Triss. Click on the fireplace. Oh, it was we're on the other side of the fireplace, so it's being weird. It's the last episode that it made me run around the building. Click on the vials of fake potions. There. I have the potion for Triss. Now to go and give the potion to Triss. I'll take that beer off you, thank you. Thank you, Geralt. I hope this potion helps. That was terrible. I dreamt Lambert was with me. He was staring at me, saying things like, Don't go dying on me, Marigold. Calling me big-headed. I'm so glad to see you. What? I'm glad you're feeling better. I know we should set out, but I have a feeling we won't be back. Perhaps ever. Won't you stay just a bit longer? With me? I suppose we have some time. I'm so happy you're back. When I saw you, all the feelings I tried to deny returned. Stronger than ever. Triss, I'm not ready to talk about the past. Of course. I, I shouldn't pressure you. I just feel so... <laughs> the powers. I'm behaving like a teenager. Let's focus on the present. I guess I disappointed you all. Forgive me. Nothing to forgive. What I felt when I learned you were alive, hard to compare to anything. Oh. Except maybe what I feel as I look at you. I missed you so. Let's see if the best bed in Kaer Morin can hold us. Oh my! <laughs> Dearie me, ah, oh no. Geralt, a pleasure, as always. 
As always. You don't remember anything? Unfortunately. Well, <laughs> you have something to look forward to then. No matter. Tell me, oh my. how did the battle end? They broke into the lab, killed Leo, stole our mutagens, and escaped. Poor Vesemir. Another protege dead prematurely. We delayed the funeral until you awoke. Thank you. As for the mutagens, their loss could prove catastrophic. Let's not lose any more time. Unless there's something you'd like to ask me? Know anything more about the sorcerer who ransacked the lab? He's very powerful. He completely controlled the energy he drew from the Circle. We may soon be facing another Vilgefortz. Who? No matter. I have something I'd like to teach you. Geralt, can we go? Can you restore my memory? I'd have to examine you. There's a good chance your memory will return on its own. How much chance? That's difficult to say. It might help if I knew what caused you to lose your memory. Well, no time for that now. Geralt, can we go? The theft. What are its possible consequences? Most sorcerers and rulers would sell their greedy, power-hungry souls to get the mutagens. Only a master of the arcane arts can use that knowledge. Not many of those left. What about wealthy merchants, dukes, kings? Perhaps. Anything's possible. But speculating wastes time. We just don't have enough information. True. Geralt, can we go? We shouldn't keep Vesemir waiting. Come on, then. We don't know where the bandits came from or who's behind them. We'll draw attention if we venture out as a group. By splitting up, we can also cover more territory. I'll go west. I know a few people there, and I prefer the coastal then climate. Then I'll head east, to Kedwin, unless someone objects. That's fine. Which way should I go? South, to Tamaria. King Foltest owes you a debt of gratitude. Some time ago, you removed a curse from his daughter. You might happen on the bandits' trail there. And you, Triss? I'll try to use my influence to find the bandits. If I learn anything, I'll contact Geralt. And we're off to Tamiria. Awesome. I'll gather what information I can and find you in Vizima. Triss. Don't, Geralt. I detest goodbyes. I'm liable to cry, and there's nothing more pathetic than a sorceress in tears. Don't get killed, Geralt. I don't think I could deal with that again. What? I'll see you soon. Don't get killed, I couldn't deal with that again. You know he didn't get killed the last time, right? Right there. Not killed. See you, Triss. Right, so obviously there's something between Geralt and Triss. We don't have Yenna for yet to complicate matters. <laughs> Classically. You mean cliche. <laughs> I wonder if that was concept art at one time. Caroline, I'm tired. It's not far now, we'll be there soon. Chapter one. So what did I just play? I'm cold. We'll fetch you warm milk and honey. You'd like that. Very much. Thank you, Caroline. What are those dogs doing? Dogs? Oh. 
Marvin. Do exactly as I say. This is important. Run to the inn as fast as you can, and don't look back. Understand? Easily. Run! Why is that with an evil light green? What the hell? Shut the gate, quickly! The beast! The beast is attacking! Sound the alarm! Melatelli must have sent you. There's a woman outside. Help! No! Don't open the gate! The beasts will enter! These dogs are deadly. You people are monsters! Stand aside! I'll save them myself! Stop. Don't go out there alone. Damn you! We're all going to die! <laughs> Magic, surely. The beast! Uh-oh. Geralt, look! The time of the sword and axe approaches. The time of the white frost and white light. The time of madness and disdain. To it, the final age. The world will perish amidst ice and be reborn with a new sun. Reborn of elder blood, of hen care, of a planted seed. A seed that will not sprout but burst into flames. Okay. The old elven prophecy of Itlina. I hope he's alright. It seems he saved us from the beast. Yes, seems so. Oh, I do hope he's not hurt. I'll need to find someone to take care of him. He shouldn't be alone. We'll stay at the inn in the meantime. Wait a minute. I ran into wild dogs on my way here, but they were nothing like these, and I don't mean just the green fur. Know anything about them? They've been terrorizing the village for some time. Every few days, a villager is killed. The pack is led by a large hound, perhaps a wolf. People call it the beast. Someone might pay to have the beast slain. That's what witchers do, isn't it? But enough about monsters. What brings you here? I'm seeking men who wear the sign of the salamander. Seen anyone like that in the area? Shh, not so loud. There was someone, but the peasants grow silent at the mere mention of him. The Reverend might know more. You may also want to ask him about the beast. I'll do that. Did you want to ask me something? It's been a long time since I've heard mention of Salamandra. Do you know anything about them? I think they're a group of bandits who terrify the locals. Yesterday, they returned a boy they'd whipped with a lamia. A lamia? A mayhem crop with small barbs and hooks. It rips away skin and flesh with each strike. Most civilized countries have banned them. The boy was delirious, muttered something about a ransom and the reverend. Sadly, he grew feverish, and he died that night. Thanks. I may stay longer than I planned. Why the interest in Salamandra? They killed someone I was fond of, and stole something of mine. I wouldn't want to be them. Do we know each other? It's me, Shawnee. Don't you recognize me? Whatever happened to you? I heard you died during a massacre in Rivia. Unfortunately, I lost my memory. I recall the last few weeks, nothing more. Hmm. I'm afraid I can't help. Medicine's a fledgling science here in the North. I can say that your memory might come back on its own. It's not that bad. I'm actually getting used to it. I hate to admit it, but... Sorcerers are somewhat more effective at this than we are. Maybe one of them could help. What brings you to this village? 
I'm traveling to St. Libiota's hospital in Vizima to help fight the Catriona plague. When are you leaving? Once I've helped the victims of the dog attacks, I guess. I can't abandon them. It'll delay me, but some are certain to die without my aid. So what'll become of Alvin? I don't know. I'll look after him for now. Maybe a villager will take him in. He seems clever enough. Surely someone will want him. Did you want to ask me something? We'll speak later. Will we? I, don't, I think I missed a question. Did you want to ask me something? No. I got them all. We'll speak later. Calm down. Everything will be okay. Right. To the Reverend. This is quite eerie. So it seems to be killing dogs. The monkey like creature. Yeah. Right, I heard something creepy there. It seems to be when a dog dies, those monsters are its ghosts. Right. 
stop. Uh, what are you? A witcher. We're militia. We keep the peace. I'll be going. We need to see you're not ill. I'm immune. Don't know what that means. We got a check. What's that? Eh, uh, chip. Well, keep. Well, you look foul, but healthy. Move along. Godspeed. <sighs> You've killed them. Very weird. Very, very weird. Right. I will take on whatever just growled at me in the next video. Because that's a wee bit stressful. Okay, so tune in to episode 5 to see how I get on with this beastie. Eh? Uh, and see if I can find the reverend. Okay, folks, thanks very much for watching. Bye!